Why I would personally prefer to take Magnolone every day instead of every other day. What's up everybody, it's that white boy from the yard, I'm back at it again with another video and today we are talking about why I personally prefer Magnolone every day instead of every other day. At first, I'm not a doctor, but don't have any form of medical degree so whatsoever. I don't pretend to be a doctor. Don't listen to what I say. This is all my personal opinion and how I see things that would do to my body. Always go to a doctor before using any form of supplementations. All right, so like I said, why I would personally prefer to take Magnolone every day instead of every other day. If you would take Magnolone every other day, and you was planning on taking five milligrams every day, you technically need to inject 10 milligrams of Magnolone every other day. It should be fine for most people, but even with the orals, I already noticed when I would take 10 milligrams uh, LGD solo uh, without running a test base or whatever, I would feel suppressed. That's just garbage. I don't want to feel like that. So I mostly uh, kept it at five milligrams for a couple of weeks and that was fine. That, that works best for me personally. If I would take Magnolone every other day, I would still do the 10 milligrams, but, but I tried it the first day. Kind of got a stomach ache or something, obviously, because it's the first time doing it and my body is always super sensitive to stuff like that but then again you would still have 10 milligrams that day so i took 10 milligrams the first day in combination with folatonic um, which i wanted to do 50 milligrams every day um, so which was 30 milligrams every other day so i had 10 milligrams of magnolone i had 30 milligrams of folatonic in one ml barrel like i said a little bit stomach ache i didn't feel comfortable i already could feel some sort of suppression something's not good with my body it didn't respond that well but i, I didn't want to give up so I waited a day and the next day after that I did the same thing just to see how my body would respond then. Kind of happened the same thing not with the stomach maybe a little bit but um, I felt suppressed. I knew this wasn't the right move for me because 5 milligrams of LGD slash Magnolone should be optimal for me and if I would think about it then sure it extended the, itself you know in the body but um, it's still 10 milligrams every day technically you still would put the 10 milligrams of your body on one day so for me i just noted this notice the suppression you know I, I don't really like it personally so i choose to just do five milligrams every day and then if i think like logically you know um five milligrams every day or for some people 10 milligrams every day you know just as long as it's like every day is it's more stable you know it breaks down in the body after a couple of hours it has like a longer half-life but again you would have like 10 milligrams in your system every day which doesn't work for me personally i mean i have i've had guys coming up to me that had like 50 milligrams of oral lgd or, or even magnolone 25 um, and they were fine, you know, they didn't notice any suppression at all. Um, but if you run a test base, suppression is not there or you won't even notice it, okay? So that's why I would personally choose injectable SARM slash Magnolone slash Folitonic every day instead of every other day. Although in my mind, I personally prefer every other day so you could give your body an injection site some rest. That would be the better option. I understand if you don't want to pin yourself every day for a couple of weeks, but just to keep it stable and don't feel suppressed because I'm doing this like a short burst cycle, you know, a three weeks bulking, three weeks cutting, something like that. I don't want to add in the test base. I want to see what it's really like. So that's why I experiment with compounds. I want to see how it's like. And if I add something on top of that, it will be much more powerful. So I, I don't really know where it begins with. I mean, that's something for in the future, in the near future. So uh, we will look up to that. I, that was it for today's video. Thanks a lot for watching again. If you liked the video, please don't forget to subscribe. Go to FromTheArtNation.com and Anabolic TV. Take a look out there as well. Don't forget the sources and save yourself some money. Drop a follow on my IG. And that was it. I'm out. <laughs>